guys, it's Elizabeth in the library, and yes, I'm very cold, that's why I'm wearing a beanie. I just got an interesting question in the library orientation workshop where a student was wondering how they could save money with buying textbooks. So if you're a student, you've probably realized that textbooks cost way more than your courses most times, and I personally think that sucks. So here are my not sanctioned tips for saving money for textbooks. So the first thing is when you're registering for a class, you if you have a choice, you can see if your class has something what that's called an OER, that stands for an Open Educational Resource, and what that will mean is that your textbook is free. So in the class schedule, you can always look up your textbook, and if you see this little symbol, which is like the zero whatever sign, um, that will tell you that your textbook is free. So that's the first way you can save money. And while we're talking about it, when you go to register for your class, hopefully that's you know as soon as possible so you have lots of time to order a textbook. And this is the other trick. So when you go in, you see the textbook that you need, you can then try to order it from the bookstore or from any other place. Just make sure, and I mentioned this in the how to order your textbook video, that if you need to have a certain edition of the book that you get that and then if you need an access code you're going to need to get that because the access code is usually for like an online lab and that's usually what costs a lot of money but in my case when i'm a student which is often enough when i'm taking a class i go in i see which textbook i have i see if i can use an older edition i will sometimes email the professor and let them know that i'm going to be in their class and ask them if I'm allowed to use an older edition of the textbook. And if they say yes, then I basically go on and I search some of these um, different websites that are available to buy used textbooks. And that's how I save money. Sometimes I'm not able to save money and that part is not cool, but you know, I do the best I can because the biggest problem when you're trying to save money and you're buying these books from Amazon or any of the other places, which they're not always cheaper than the textbook, than buying textbooks at the bookstore, but sometimes they are, if you usually have to make sure that you order them in enough time, because sometimes it could take months to get them and you don't want to be stressed out and have to buy the same textbook twice. So I hope that answered your question. Will you actually asked if I could recommend sites and it really kind of depends on your book. So we'll kind of hopefully this what this little answer this this video answered your question <laughs> and good luck with saving money on textbooks and good luck with your classes. All right. Bye.